All right, let's have this training. Uh, we've got the Twitch happening, so it's using the all new software. It does appear to want to melt my laptop. I might unplug the mouse and get my cooling pad going. Uh, let's get the a bit more of the beautiful me. Over a huge lag even on my laptop. This is just eating me up. Live now. Alright, so it says it's streaming. No. Anybody here? Some lag spikes. How's the audio? This is the stream. Hey, Goldie, what's going on? Uh, can you guys hear everything? Can you hear the sound of the game? Can you hear me? I'm using a new. Uh, uh, streaming service, so sorry. Uh, streaming program just updated my OBS, so all my settings were out of whack. Do I need to, do I need to change the volume at all? X. Or should I just get straight into it? Quality is really low. The sound quality. How do I change that? Let's go settings. So Goldie's saying sound quality is really low. Max is saying everything seems good. No, the video quality is low, is it? How do I get the video quality up? Broadcast settings. Encoding. Should I put my max bit rate up? Put up a little bit. See, see if that does anything. Uh, so the video quality is worse than yesterday. Is that what you're saying? I noticed some when I uploaded to YouTube, they're pretty bad. I was also trying to get. Try and mess around with the chat and see if I get the chat thing happening here. Alright, so the CLR browser doesn't appear to be doing anything. At least not what I wanted it to do. Hey! Wait, it just said that Asma the Unicorn was here. It's not showing up on stream. Maybe I need to just do the window browser. Alright, well, it's something I can mess around with in the future. I'm trying to get the chat up on the screen, but it doesn't seem to be going. Can somebody type something else? I'll type something. Type, type, type. Let's see if it shows up in my uh... Yo, yo, okay, so I've got. Ah, oh, yeah, it is showing up. It's showing up on the left hand side. It looks too opaque. Can you guys read that? Should I make it less opaque? And I should also probably put it on the right hand side. Underneath me. Hey, you can see people in the background. Okay, get properties. No, that's not going to go. Edit scene. Ah, I can just move it over here like this. Hey, 
and you guys can still see. Let me know if it's obnoxious at all, or if it's distracting, or if I should make the actual game screen smaller so the chat doesn't go over the game. It's hard to read, so I need to make it less... Alright, how do we do this? Bang. Properties. No. Ah, oh, opacity. Okay. 20 second delay? It's pretty hardcore. Yeah, I'm, my laptop is actually lagging really hard. Six second? Is that, how's that? Is that better to read? I don't want it to be too overpowering when I'm playing the game. Uh, yeah, and also let me know if you want me to change the uh, screen size of the actual game, so maybe it doesn't... How's that? But then if you guys chat too much, you won't be able to read it. I'll just move it down, maybe like there. How's that? Is that okay? Yeah, the new software is really lagging me hard. I might mess around with some stuff later on. Alright, so I need to go back to before I got to the previous... You guys were watching me last night. I got up to the... One of the Colossus. Was that hours intentional? That was a... Uh, that was another pun. Play on words. That's what I feel like. That's what I feel like, Goldie. Hey, we got four viewers. Is that... Am I one of those, or is it somebody else? I don't know how to check who's actually watching. chat thing worked. It was actually surprisingly easy in the end. One of the reasons I had to download the latest OBS was because it has a preview mode. I don't know the names. Yeah, I got up to number four, but now it's sort of well before number four. So, because my internet cut out yesterday. You get to relive that part. So it's... Yeah. Is it a horse? I now need to remember how to use the controls. Who's aggro? You guys keep making these references to names and I have no idea who they are or what they are. Hey, get on there. Get on my horse! Oh, okay. I didn't know it was my horse. How am I meant to know that? Has anyone said that? Have you ever played this game, Jin? No. Uh, well, I, in the course of one day, I already forgot how great this game looks. Oh, does he? Oh, okay. I don't know if I like the name Agro. Is it Agro or Agro? Yeah. I don't actually know how long I was playing for yesterday before yeah. you guys... before I even noticed that I had disconnected. <clears throat> yeah. Maybe that hard to catch back up there. Yeah. I'm pretty sure this is where I was going to go. Horse is tireless, by the way. Hey, Leontin! Welcome to the stream. 
There's, he there's heaps of lag today. I think it's my new software. I'll need to figure it out. But you guys can interact just fine. I'll just obnoxiously say something that is a purpose, nothing at all that you guys are talking about every now and then. You a fan of this game, Leonton? What's two hours, X? The delay? Oh, uh, maybe, maybe the thumbnail was uh, the actual loading screen or something like that. Uh, yeah, we're up to number four. Uh, stop! Stop! How do I make it? I'll just run him into a wall to make it stop. All right, let's get off. Oh, awesome! Another fan joins the stream. Uh, I have no idea what I'm doing, by the way. So please don't make fun of me while I fumble around trying to figure out what's going on. I don't even need to go down here yet. I need my horse back. Ah. Uh, I did do this part yesterday and then my internet cut out, so I just, I'm just going to repeat it. Hey, my horse, he just came running for me. But I didn't kill the monster or anything like that. Yeah, Asmo is... I don't know. I don't know what he's doing. He's basically sitting there just shaking with anticipation and excitement at every new Colossus I encounter. Alright, here we go. So this is basically where I got up to yesterday. You mean artwork is in visually, or you mean just where it's a piece of art? Like this game as a piece of art? Is that what you mean, Leontin? I mean, visually it's absolutely not the best of the games I've ever seen. Even just, I played it yesterday and then just loading it up now, it just, somehow, it feels like it looks even better. Alright, here we go. Let's get out of here. Agro, agro. And his brother works, uh, the telecommunications company, I guess. Alright, 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 alright. Yo! Look at this. <laughs> please, please don't put the words Colossus and Dick together again. This could, this this Colossus has a massive thing hanging from between its hind legs. Looks like my cat. All right, let's see what's going on here. This, okay, so probably the single most impressive thing about this game is the way it catches the sense of scale. Like the Colossus really do feel massive. They feel colossal. Uh, I think Axe was making that up about Asmo's uh, father. Asmo! Uh, actually, number four is the only one that you haven't said... ...that you haven't in advance warned me that it's going to be so awesome and so exciting, so... Alright, alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I can't see anything. When was the last time you actually played the game, Leonton? Oh, he's all the way over there! This music is really haunting too, by the way. It feels like... shiny? No, I'm not sure. This music reminds me of a movie that escapes me right now. Alright, here we go, here we go. This is where I got up to yesterday, so... Oh, I forgot the buttons! Oh no! I forgot the buttons! Yes. Yeah, this is one of those games that was always on my uh, to-do list. I just never got around to it. In fact, I never even saw any videos of it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't shake, don't shake. Alright, let my grip... Oh, whoa! Whoa, he's really... <laughs> he's kind of dancing. Ooh, right here. Ooh, what is this? I see a fissure. Here we go. You're in trouble. This might even be the most visually impressive boss so far. I don't know, that's a big... Seems like a big statement. Okay, so what's this actually doing? Uh, Alright, here we go, here we go. BAM! Yeah, honestly, I don't know anything about it. I don't know how I would spoil this. Especially being friends with it. 
like IRL friends with Asmo who is the official super fan. Where's my horse right now? Where's Azra? Yeah, the Colossi are phallus. Basically, uh... I don't know. I have a habit of, uh... Finding phallic objects where other people disagree with me, so... Asmo is a colossal many things. Hey, I actually don't even need this, the Twitch window open now, but... Hey, my grip meter isn't even a problem right now. I'm just smashing this guy. See, this is... I mean, it's still got this epic scale, but... This is the, the only time, like, my complaint I had when I was chatting to you about it before, as I was saying, once you're here, basically just holding on and stabbing the same spot repeatedly. <laughs> kind of enjoying the spectacle. Whoa, okay, now I'm up in the air. <laughs> really? Do I have to kill him? So he has no health now. I kind of just. All right, all right, he's dead. Uh, this poor guy. Oh my goodness! Look how huge he looks right now. Look how tiny I am. That's the shot. Can I still move around? No. Yeah, I'm down to that. One of the hardest things about this game, I think, is actually killing these Colossus, like, the Colossi, that I feel like I'm not motivated enough to actually do this, because they're just these giant noble beasts. You guys can talk trivia, and I won't look at the chat if you guys want to compare uh, Colossus dicks. Asmo seems to have gone... oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, you can tell it's intentional as well, like... I was, I was talking yesterday about how it feels like oh, you're just a psychopath then, Leontin. Yeah, I was talking yesterday about how it feels like a similar story to episode 3 of Star Wars, whereas right now I'm Anakin, the one, the person I loved has died, and now I have to kill to save her life, I guess. I have to kill. This is already like being done far, in a far superior way to episode 3. Like, imagine how awesome Episode 3 of Star Wars would have been had... No, spoiler alert. Because he basically just chops off Windu's hand, kills some younglings, and then goes into exile, right? Whereas in the original trilogy, he has this reputation of killing thousands of Jedi. How awesome would it be if he had to actually hunt down, say, the, tr the elite Jedi from the Council? Yeah, kind of like in this game. So there's like 12 of them or something like that, and he had to hunt them each down, and each one... Each, each time he killed one, he went further and further to the dark side and it became easier and easier for him. And even the Dormin, they're called the Dormin in this, could be compared to Palpatine. Oh sweet, I'm going to be on a bird now. Bird of prey. He even looks a bit like Anakin. Oh, 
Wait, hey, get on. Why? Why would I get on? There we go. I think I also talked about this yesterday as well. What I really like about this story is it yeah. feels like it's the continuation of a story that has already occurred. Like when you arrive, obviously you've just been on an epic adventure. You get here and now you need to do this. This is this feels like the, the final dungeon of an even bigger game. Hey, where's my sword? Right, where am I going now? Yeah, I don't have that attachment, so it's really it makes it even harder for me to be uh, killing these giant creatures. Yeah. Oh, you were talking about how you feel in this game. You're meant to have the attachment to the player, not as though you're living vicariously through him, but as though you're coming along for the ride with him. Is that what you're talking about? Ah, yeah. And this this lull of music with just ambient ambient sounds and this giant empty world in between the epic boss battles is just a really great dynamic. It's just it's a bizarrely made game by any standards. Not in a bad way. Yeah. Right, just making sure I'm going the right way here. Yeah. I feel like this is the way I just went. Yeah. This is the way I just went. This is the way I just went, right? Yeah. All right. Let me just check out this amazing map screen again. So I think I wanted to go above me. I wanted to be north, but running parallel to where I was there. I think. Oop, oop. Yeah, it's. It also gives you time to think. I don't know how... I don't know what the yeah. demographic of this game is, yeah. whether... Yeah. You know, uh, Call of Duty people would be playing this and whether they want that time to reflect on their actions and what they're doing, but... Like, it... it fills me with a sense of... Not even just foreboding, like, sorrow as yeah. well. Yeah. Sorrow yeah. the right word? I don't know. But it's it's a good time for uh, you know, to be circumspect. Yeah. I, think I need to go yeah, this way. This is north, right? And I want to know about the structure, like the nature of the structure. Like, what is this doing here, and why did I even come here in the first place? I guess I knew that yeah. this is where I could resurrect my uh, my love. I've never played Hotline Miami, so maybe I could do a blind run through yeah. that. Yeah. And that's an yeah. intentional artistic choice in Hotline Miami. Yeah. I guess it doesn't even yeah. doesn't need to be yeah. an intentional artistic choice to still have that effect. Yeah. Yo. I guess when you make a game, like yeah. everything is an intentional choice, right? Was it the music? Alright, so something's gonna go down here. Yeah, I'm letting the sunshine. Ooh! Yeah! Oh, look how awesome those clouds look. I wanna I want look at them, but the light. Yeah, I think I've only seen... Whoa, this is, looks very reminiscent of Eco. Uh, is this where I should be going? 
Can my horse go through the wall? I feel like this isn't where I'm meant to be. Gee, but uh, should I go back out and find some sunlight and double check? Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah. You sure it wouldn't just be frantic swearing and yeah. expulsion of the obscenities? Because the, they seem to be my uh, my two modes. See what's going on here. Okay, slow down, slow down. I grow, I grow. Okay, okay. Why is this the camera angle? Did I just do that? Alright. I'm assuming it's on the other side of this rock. Not the yeah. rock itself. Yeah, alright, I'm going this way. Yeah. Am I in the right place or am I. Am I still in the right place if I go this way? Yeah! Yeah! Whoa! Okay. I kind of want to explore this place anyway. Can I dip my head underwater? Oh, I can jump. Let's get this camera angle. This would be, imagine if this were you in real life, how creepy it would be to be swimming in this cold water completely alone. Okay, cool. Like, there's no other living thing that you know of. Like, your imagination would just run wild, right? This would be the most isolating experience right now. You leave your horse back on the shore. Like, uh, has anyone ever read the novel uh, Rendezvous with Rama by Arthur C. Clarke? It's a science fiction novel, classic science fiction novel. It's... Alright, you got me there. You got me there. I don't know where I'm going. Can I actually go underwater? How do I go underwater? I... Ah, okay, I can go underwater. Ah. Yo, Leonton. Anyway, this um, novel, uh, Rendezvous with Rama, it's it's all about, it's about these, I think it's just three people, it's been a long time since I read it, and they're, they go down to space to explore this mysterious object that's water, and then it's just this one massive cylinder that they spend, I guess, days, I can't remember, uh, exploring. And I think at one point they even find a pool of water which they go into, but it's just, the novel just gives you the sense of awe and isolation that I guess I kind of feel in this game. It's been a long time since I read that book, though. It's strange that I would think about it right now. I really recommend that book for anyone who uh, likes sci-fi. Whoa. That's, pr that's, that's pretty wild. This is also by far the fastest movie Colossus thus far. Yeah, as I was saying before, but this one's pretty wild. Ooh. And the music starts, just this one violin. Ooh.
Uh, Leontin throwing the gauntlet down to Asmo. Ah, okay, so the grip meter just turns into an air meter when I'm underwater. Cool, that's really elegant. What am I gripping? I think I'm gripping my lungs to the oxygen. I think that's what I'm gripping. I love how my presence isn't even noticed by these this Colossus right now. You think it would though, but these lands are so empty. It's not even any like it's also devoid of like explicit environmental storytelling. I don't think you need particularly strong grip for full play either. Oh, it notices me? Okay. I can hear it now, I just heard something. Was that my horse foraging around? Uh, I'm still not sure if I'm going to the right place. Okay, okay. Whoa! Okay. What a what an awesome view from underneath the water with the uh, the ray the beams of light. It could so easily just swoop down and shatter me right now, right? I don't know. That's a pretty dramatic picture, don't you think? Can I just, do I have to climb up its tail? Don't you want to know the story of these ruins as well? Oh. Can I jump up that high? In the water? Maybe I need to use my bow and arrow or something. Why is he moving away from me? No! Avion, okay. Asmo appears to be AFK. I can't use my bow and arrow in water. Maybe I need to be underwater so he can't see me. No, he can see me anyway. Maybe I can see me. Oh my goodness! Ah, come back! Alright. Alright. What the hell am I doing? You mean hands out instead of uh, a weapon? Oh, okay. The sound is changing. I was going to use the bow and arrow. I clicked on the bow and arrow. What's the button to shoot again? But I need to get to land to use the bone arrow. Where's the closest dry area? Over there? Is that kind of the objective to beat Dorman? Alright, I'm swimming back. There has to be a closer dry area. Over there, I'm going to this one. This is why. 
if I was playing a first person shooter, it would be so easy, right? There'd be much less tension and much less um, pressure to not look stupid if I'm just blasting away mindlessly. Yeah, I know, I know who Dolan is. Palpatine, I'll call him Palpatine. This is so far away. I'm really going to the wrong one. Yeah, I think he's spoiled almost everyone so far. Oh, I don't even think this is a, the right place to go to. I, really, I do feel kind of foolish. I'm also very inexperienced with these types of games, so... If it's reusing any old tropes or gameplay mechanics, I'll never figure it out. Hey! Oh! 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 Let me stand! Let me stand! Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yes! Yes! Should I hit it right in the face? Oh, that's a straight shot. Okay, he's flying. Now what? Oh, okay. It's a little bit scary. Now that he's flying around, he's just fucked off. Alright. Okay, I can. gonna talk to me again. You already told me that. I gained its attention. Now he's just flying around. Now what? Do I have to climb up one of these things and then try to jump on his tail as he's flying around or what? It's its tail. It's not a very good swimming technique, but it's like half... <laughs> yeah. It's okay. It's okay. I guess that's probably less immersion breaking than if he started getting just frustrated with me. Just like audibly groaning whenever I did something like Ugh. Just sarcastically making comments, like Asmo or Rax usually do. Hey, I can't even grip on here. Oh, that's because I can just. Okay. Yo! Yes! Alright. Is it the right spot because I have to climb up? Or... And shoot him again. Oh, oh, okay, there he is. There he is. Come here, big boy. Oh, yeah, you felt that. Do you really enjoy watching me just fumbling around having no clue what I'm meant to be doing, Leontin? Maybe I should just keep hitting him with this thing. Oh, it's coming right at me. Oh! Oh, no! I 
try to jump and grip. I gotta kill this thing. Oh, he's coming back! He's coming back! I got it! I got it! I'm on! I'm on! Oh. Alright. The music is picked up. Whoa! Alright, where do I kill it? How do I stab it? I don't know where I have to kill it. I'm gonna move down to the tail. Oh, he's going really fast. Well, maybe it should just be the head. Alright. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going this way. No, this was definitely the wrong way. Whoa, this looks pretty spectacular. Oh, and it's really hard for me to run into the wind. Don't raise the volume too loudly. You don't know what effects my uh, hypnotic voice will have on you. He's clapping his wings down. Oh, what do I do? How do I... I don't know how to kill him. Do I need to get underneath him? Whoa, I just fell completely off. Oh! Where do I kill him? How do I kill him? There was no sigil. Should I just stab him? Oh, that was totally worth it just to fall off into the water. I need Leon Leonton to really throw on the gauntlet down to Asmo here. How many other people are streaming this game right now? Hey, I got six viewers! Hey, everyone who's watching! I'm sorry for being really awful at this game, by the way. Alright, come here! Hey, where'd it go? Just left? Did I defeat it? Did I demoralize it into leaving? Where is it? I should press L1. Oh, okay, no, it's definitely still here. Where are the sigils, though? I couldn't see them. Oops. I feel like Esmo is just watching the game. In silence, wishing he could play it again for the first time. Oh, he's coming. This is not happy. He's not a happy bird of prey. Now it's circling over here. Should I be... Can I somehow get up there? Is that what I need to do? How is that even physically possible to just do those swoops? This is... Oh, here it comes. Where do I kill it? How do I kill it? 
and you just stab it to cut its freaking wings off. Oh, okay, you just stab it in the wings. How come this one doesn't have a sigil? I think I should get further down the wing. Or maybe on the tail. Oh, I'm running out of grip. I'm running out of grip. Stabilize, stabilize. If I stab its tail enough, it shouldn't be able to hold a straight path, right? Alright. I feel like this is doing almost no damage. I'm just perforating it at this point. Are you guys thinking it glitched because I'm s my skill level is so high at this game that you assume the only way I could be this good is if the game glitched and gave me some kind of unfair handicap? Eventually die. No. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Kind of like separate its cerebral cortex from the rest of its spine. Because I couldn't even grip onto this part, right? I think I need help. Do I need to get underneath it or something? Like, soft underbelly? Oh, hang on. Maybe I'll use my uh, sword. Ah, oh, no! Next time he stabilizes, I'll use my sword to see if anything happens. Yo, hold you on the. Ah, I see. I can see now. Ah, uh, I didn't need your help. I discovered it all by myself. game had PlayStation 4 graphical fidelity would enhance the experience. And if so, what would the extra graphical powers be used for? Oh, there must just be so many nerve endings right at the end of this thing's tail. It's so much pain. Oh, that looks so spectacular. It's amazing that they even tried to do this game on the PlayStation 2. Oh, I'm 
right between his shoulder blades or whatever. Oh, I was just sliding back. the sigil. Oh, how do I see? Is there somewhere to grip there? It didn't look like there was any way to grip. That's why I never went out there earlier. Ah, okay. I can't grip. It's like Velcro. Oh, he's not happy. We're upside down now. Ah, I fell off, I fell off. Oh! Oh, I thought I died from hitting the, uh, the concrete. There's not even any power-ups or weapon pickups in this game, right? <laughs> why is this, why is this version so much more epic? Because of the ineptitude? That's why you guys thought it was glitching. Oh, he's coming. This guy, just fly away, it's almost dead. this song to be the soundtrack next time I make love. Oh, wrong weapon, wrong weapon. Oh, shit. Bam, he's dead. Oh, I just fell off. Imagine if I fell on top of this stone wall and I just died. I just wonder what else is on board of. Mm. Oh, now I need to swim all the way back or what? at the, uh, the streaming software. Like I was looking at my webcam image. What's Jim playing today? What are you playing? You playing a game? Oh, you're playing LOL? My roommate's playing League of Legends behind me. He's missing out. He should be, he should be streaming into this. Tuning into this stream. It's actually... It feels like it's going to be quite a long game too. Oh, I've only been going for, what? Two and a half hours. Do you have a favorite Colossus mark? You don't have to tell me which one it is, just are there any in particular that stand out for you? I just feel like I'm going down some evil 
Bram Stoker's Dracula path here. This temple? Viewers, we're up to five. Maybe my roommate is watching. Uh, Abro. Three was the guy with the, the Colossus with the sword, right? Look at these birds. Are there more birds? There's more birds now. Maybe that's just my imagination. So you also listed 15 as one that was very popular. Are there any like hidden Easter eggs or anything? Like hidden Colossus? Or they're all, you need to defeat all of them to get un unlock the full story. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, I want to create a highlight package for my stream that will be like the center of the highlight package. Ooh, it's all... Mm, sorry, it's pretty late. It's all lush and green over here. You, what is that? Is that a shadow? Or is that just a graphical glitch? As I get closer to completing the game, you should tell me some of the Easter eggs and stuff. Okay. What are this? Uh, if it's not a spoiler or anything, you can tell me what the secret areas kind of reveal, or what the purpose is, what the Easter egg actually is. I like how all these areas as well, it, um, there's always some shade, and some reason why you can't just abuse your sword. Ooh. So what I'm up to now, I'm up to six, right? Abro. Like even the sword is some kind of mystical weapon, right? Like, it's some kind of sword of power, or... So obviously I've come across this sword on my journeys, like, I want to know the story behind how I got this sword of power as well. It's just leaving it up to my imagination. Uh, I totally just forgot where I am. Leontin's back. If you can hear those funny noises, that's my wife talking. Yeah. 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 I'll probably be looking at playing for another hour or so. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I. I mean, when I say I want to know the story of how I got the sword and how my partner died and all this kind of stuff, like, that's a, that's a credit to the game. It's, it's leaving it up to my imagination to fill in the gaps, like the sense of mystery behind how I how this adventure started is really cool. Yeah, it, it lets you fill in the gaps. And that's a, very obviously an artistic choice. Oh, do I have to go all the way over there?
Do I need to... Can I take my horse down there, or what? I don't think I can. I think I gotta jump, or swim, or something. Maybe I'll jump, and like a suicide. Let's have a little look see around. Ooh. Ooh, forgive me. Oh, oh what? Ah, this way. Hey. This is so annoying for my horse. Just Yeah, that's my plan, that's my plan. <clears throat> Why is that fun? You guys enjoy my watching my Oh wait, oh, I don't know what that is. What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Oh, it looked like a neck of some kind of serpent creature or something. Maybe that is the Colossus. No. So this way? Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah! 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 Oh, little tree. You can hear the wind and the wind tone. Yeah! That's cool, Goldie. Appreciate you being here. Sometimes I've, I don't have that many followers, but some of the oh, what is this? I'm like blind. Where am I in the desert? Some of the followers I've accrued for the last few streams have haven't even said anything in the chat. That's that's really surprising, actually. I guess I'm kind of also going into streaming blind, kind of like how I'm playing these games blind. Was it intended? Do you think that people would have to find their way on foot sometimes? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, really? I didn't know that. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, I'm really. Yeah, that would have taken forever if I hadn't have had my horse. Assuming I'm even at the right place now. It looks as though I am. Alright, I'm gonna get off now. Do you think I haven't played uh, Red Dead Redemption or Red Dead Revolver? Do you think it was influenced by this game and the use of the horse? Because I was kind of assuming that Metal Gear Solid 5 was influenced by that game, but. Possible that it was influenced by this game or both? Hmm. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter what's intentional. Like, oftentimes the most fun things in games are the unintentional things. <laughs> yeah, I guess I guess you were right, Goldie. People have been riding horses for generations. Kind of a silly thing for me to say. Well, I wonder what the first horse in a video game was, or what the first vehicle in a video game was to speed up your adventures. Ooh, I get to explore the temple. This is a nice change of pace as well. I like it. All the areas are really different. Spaceship. Yeah, that makes sense. But I mean, not just you being in a vehicle, I mean, them adding the vehicle as a mechanic to speed up your adventuring, whereas the rest of the game would take place on foot or something. Yeah, Yoshi, maybe Yoshi counts. No, you it has to be earlier than Yoshi, right? Oh, this is a massive underground temple. It's huge. 
Who built this thing? Yeah, I think we're, we're trying not to be pedantic with pronouns. It's really hard to, especially when you're streaming, it just naturally comes out. I refer to everything that's uh, ambiguously gendered as he. I've said he many times also. need to jump down? Like, what the hell? What the F, man? Oh, yeah, I can jump down here. I'm sure of it. Ooh, this is a, kind of a new mechanic. Like, it's simple, but... Oh, no! I thought I was falling to my death. the effects of, they obviously put a lot of effort into the hair effects in this game. I guess the hair plays such a big part because that's where you grip onto but oh, no, I kind of just don't want him to see me yet. Hey the plaster you can call me Mark or you can hold me balls. Either way, either way, I'm happy. Welcome back to the stream. We're not playing Undertale though. Well, I think I need to grip onto his, his gorilla hands next time he punches the ground. What's he doing? Oh, he's gonna destroy his way out of the temple. Is that what's gonna happen? Whoa, looks so awesome. Yeah, yeah, oh, come on, come on, get up, get up. Well, this is kind of similar mechanic to, uh, ah, oh, hit me. Oh, he took off half my health. Oh, is it? Okay, cool. It sounded like a small child screaming. Is that in the game, or is this like something happening outside my house? How's your day been, the blaster? Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, I don't even like tablets, but I, they're probably pretty good now. I had a couple a few years ago, and they just... The power just wasn't good enough for it to be worth it for me, but maybe they're, they're, they're alright now. Oh, I whistled for Hagar accidentally. Uh, okay. He's trying to shake me off. Yeah, I'm pretty good. Oh! He was successful. Yeah, so these environments are destructible, right? He's gonna demolish this, uh, this temple. That's really sad, too. This temple, who knows how many thousands of years this temple has been sitting here for. And now I've come along to kill them. And he's gonna destroy the temple, which is basically just his tomb, right? He doesn't get out of here. No hacks, no hacks. Want to do this shit properly? Oh, I just called for <laughs> I called for the horse again. Why isn't Agra helping me? This guy needs to hack in his facial hair. Oh, he got me as well. Oh, no. Definitely avoided. Oh, but I have no health left. 
Am I gonna die and have to do this whole thing again? No, I jumped off again. Oh my goodness. Oh. Alright, so this is the first one where I've really struggled. Where death might actually die. I haven't actually died yet, other than the time I accidentally committed suicide. Oh, I didn't think the sword worked. Ah, oh, I should go into the light. Ah, oh, maybe I should be climbing out of it. Maybe the, uh... Oh! Maybe the hair on his wrist is like... A red herring. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Retry. Do I have to go back to the save point, or do I, will I start from the start of the temple? Have you played this game before, the Blaster? Pancakes. Yes, I got smushed. I got smushed. Yeah, that's my first thing. Well, I died. I died once experimenting to see if I could jump from a great height into a shallow pool of water. Hey, six viewers! Anyone's watching, feel free to chat, say hello. Don't have to though, no pressure. Now at least... <coughs> now that I've got the, uh, the chat client working on the stream... I called to Adro again. Uh, no, I, I didn't die. Did I? No, I didn't die. Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, alright, no, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. Oh, no! Magnum Glorious. I mean, are these also truly uh, destructible environments, or are they scripted? chance to run for it. I'm gonna run for it. Uh, I want to get up. Whoa! Oh, that was my cover. Go, 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 go. 
Ah! Come on! Let me let me jump on! Oh, I want to jump on his beard! Oh no! That was an ill-conceived plan. Let me go back to hiding. All right, let's just pretend that didn't happen. All right. I'm gonna try again. Here I come. Yes, I'm on. I'm on. Yeah. <laughs> Listen to this music, how heroic. I haven't, I haven't killed him yet. So that music's dynamic and changing, right? That wasn't just part of the song. Hey, how did that happen? Yeah, why did my HP max out? Oh. My grip is just... I'm gonna fall off. I can see the sigil and everything. I'm going to fall off. No! Splat! Ah, uh, okay. Alright, I'm going to try that again. So far, I haven't been able to climb up by his... the back of his hand or his beard. Okay. Yeah, I healed quite rather quickly. So, uh, no, it's not gonna work. Alright, I'm hiding. Oops. Oops, that never happened. That never happened. Here we go, here I go, here I go. Surprise! I'm gonna do the same thing as last time. Here I go. Yeah, oh, I'm doing a much better job this time. Oh, you're doomed now, you poor thing. Look how sad he looks when I see his face as well. Whoa! Oh, he's headbanging. He wants me off. Ooh. Grip holds on, he really doesn't want me here. Bam. Okay. He's got a hunchback. I just want my grip back. Oh! Making it so difficult for me. Okay, well this is kind of remedying complaints I had earlier as an all about. That's basically just standing there and mashing. It's a minor management of your grip needle. It's the only strategy. Yo, come on, no! Oh, at least to get my grip back. He's only lost a tiny bit of health, a fraction. Another sigil. It looked like his stomach had a weak point too. Because it feels like I'm not doing that much damage to the back of his head. Surprise! Here I am! Yes! Maybe I should be trying to get onto his chest. Oh really? Huh. I'm a tumbler. Born under punches. Oh. Do 
imagine trying to do this in real life? <laughs> I guess not, because these monsters don't exist in real life. <laughs> imagine it, the prize that one of these things would go for, at least this large existed in the world. I think that would actually be a sport. I think that would, be, that would definitely be a sport. Chat's going quiet. Oh. oh, my grip, my grip. Oh no! No, I'm doomed. I'm doomed. I'm doomed. No, I'm off. Oh. Oh. I only have sandals really cushion my fall. Oh yeah, well. 2015, the technology for killing these beasts would just make it totally unfair. And there'd be protesters outside, because they... You know, our planet can only support a certain number of this, right? Here we go, here I go. I'm back up on the beard. You think you'd learn, but he does not. Maybe I should be trying to find a way to attack his stomach area or another area of his body because this isn't being too successful. <laughs> maybe it, maybe that's like a new game plus unlockable. Oh, he really doesn't want me on his head. Alright, let me get my group meter back. Why doesn't he want me on his head? Ridiculous. Yo. Alright, I'm gonna run this back. Alright, I'm gonna try and make my way down like the stomach area. No, I think I need to get my grip back first. Um, does anyone know what this Colossus' name is? It's number s seven? Number seven, right? Or six? No, I think this one is six. 
Alright, so I need to get on to his lower back, I believe. No, but what's down there? It's nowhere I can stack. Maybe it's like the middle of his back. Alright, here we go. Uh, ah. The fool does not learn his folly from his follies. Right, the hardest part about hitting on the barber. Barber. Can I call it Barbara? Uh, so it would be Barbara for Barbarian, right? Oh, there it is. It's like a it's tattoo on it. Whoa, he's really trying to shake me loose. This guy's feisty. Here we go, here we go. Oh! Come on, come on! Bam! That wasn't much damage either. Oh, I'm running out of grip strength. I'm gonna move quick, please. Please! Oh. This thing's gonna take forever to kill. Yo! This might be the last one I can do tonight. Oh, what's... oh, okay. How long do you need to have your sword in the air for it to be fully charged? I didn't, like, I, I understood that sometimes I did more damage than others, but I didn't. And I assumed there was a correlation between me holding my sword up in the air. <clears throat> Alright, let's go again. My character is a supremely physical fit, by the way. Just tell me I'm not doing so much worse than you did your first time, as my or anybody else. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Okay, I didn't know that. I can see it now. Come on, come on, we gotta get on top. Alright, I'm on top, I'm on top. I need that grip. I need that grip. Alright, here he goes. This might be the first time I've had to stab one of the colossi while being. not being able to. While still scaling, like now I'm literally gravity isn't helping me hold on to it. I mean, hold on. Sheer strength. All right, here we go. Oh, okay, here we go. Up. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Bam. Now we can do power shots. All right. Yo, assuming I'm not dead. Come on, come on, run, 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 run. Hey, yeah, this is on this is the PS3 version. Which is just meant to be a high deck version, right? Yeah, this is definitely PS3. I got the uh, Shadow of the Colossus and the Eco package. And I never played this game before, so. 25 bucks, how could I not buy it? Yeah. Well, I am using my PS4 controller, so it's currently plugged in. It's a real hodgepodge of technology and gaming systems I've got set up right now. I wish you guys could see my setup. It's so amateurish. Alright, here we go, here we go. Let's go time. He's like, but this is what animals are actually like, though. Like, since I've had my cat, you realize that they just do the same things over and over again, and they never learn. And you, I mean, it's like that with people in a lot of ways as well, like, I played poker for many years, and you see that there are some people who just never adjust their behavioral patterns. They just keep falling into the same traps. 
and that's exactly what this guy is going to do, so... I mean, it's probably a limitation of the AI as much as anything. Oh. I guess... I can't think of many games where the point of the AI is to learn the, like... What is it, Alien Isolation? The alien is supposedly meant to learn. Oh, and alter its patterns based on how you've defeated it or avoided it in the past. But I've never played Alien Isolation either. Cool. My mouth's getting dry. I should have had a bottle of water. I really want to beat this thing before I stop streaming. This might be... Maybe I can squeeze one more. If I can kill him quickly, I can squeeze another one in. Ellie, do you think you can get me some water? Please? Yes! Oh yeah. Have you seen this game? Check it out. challenge is just battling against the controls, like, and does that make the game more or less fun, like, if it was so much more fluid to ride the horse or climb up and down the colossi, would the game be better or worse? Alright, hey, the sigil's gone. I need to get his face again. Definitely been the most challenging one yet. Alright, I'm gonna get myself a drink of water. Oh! Yes, yeah, still on Barber. This might be the last boss of the night. Besides, I've been on him for like, what, 30 minutes? Ridiculous. Oh, Alright, that was a good jump that time. 
Yeah, it's, it's really tough to climb around this part of it. That's what I was just talking about, the, the controls aren't that smooth, but I'm not sure if that's necessarily a bad thing. Like, I loved uh, the original Resident Evil games. Those controls were really clunky and clumsy, and by today's standards, certainly counterintuitive, but actually, that's part of what made that game so much fun. It added more tension. Oh, he's spurting his monster juice. Just bathing in a torrent of his monster brain juice. Alright, I got him now. Yeah, um, I'm sure there's a more appropriate word. It's not the controls, but it's the responsiveness or the mechanics or. You know what I mean, though, right? go for one more Colossus. Well, now that I know how to charge up my sword properly, like... I guess it's kind of a good thing that they don't tell you these things, these tricks, they just let you find out for yourself. Hey, thank you. Or they let you, your friends tell you how to do it. Entomb the giant. Alright, save it. Let's do one more. I kind of feel like playing some more duck game. Andy and Esmo, you guys up for some duck game after this? Just something light to end the night on would be fun. Another 30? Yeah, that's alright. Well, it looks like one of them is almost a child. Alright, that's cool, Esmo. You want me to play StarCraft 2? I actually don't have Legacy of the Void installed. I never quit playing StarCraft 2 maybe three quarters of the way through pots, part of the swarm. Uh, I used to. I wasn't very good though. It was the first real time strategy I actually got into since I was like a child and played. I mean, you, you, if you look at my YouTube, you'll see we've played a couple of games of Total Annihilation and a game of Red Alert, and they're just terrible at them. Yeah, so my mechanics were just terrible in StarCraft 2 and I never learned properly how to do it, so my APM was woeful. It was embarrassing. But I used Protoss, so I did alright. I got up to Diamond. I almost, when I was living in Korea too, I almost cracked Diamond. There's nothing wrong with Protoss, but probably had I chosen another race, I couldn't have handicapped myself like that long term by not learning the fundamentals. Because you just, you, I, don't, I really don't think you can get up to, say, Diamond League as Zerg or Terran with the kind of abysmally low APM that I had. Like, it was, it was embarrassing. I'm not even going to give you a number. I guarantee you it's lower than the number you're thinking right now. Where are we going? We're going this way. You know what? I totally missed if Dorman yeah. said anything to me then. What? Did Dorman say anything? Yeah. Yeah. But actually, um, yeah. Goldie, I probably will get Legacy of the Void at some point, and me and yeah. Max will do some streaming. We'll stream some. Uh, I want to. I want to play with like a total new Max. He hasn't played the game before, so we'll do some uh, Archon mode yeah. or some Allied Commanders or something like that. We'll play some uh, party games. Okay. Well, I, I was above fifty, so. <sighs> Oh, they didn't actually add them? I, I remember they were debating about adding them. Yeah. I wasn't sure if they did or not. Yeah, Yeah, I was a bit... 
I was a bit torn on that, whether they should have added it in or not. I think I'm, I prefer that they didn't. I say this as a Protoss player, but I think the game shouldn't just be about... I think mechanics should play a large part of the game. I think that's probably the part of the game that scales the best, and you can gain the most consistent edge over your competitors that way. So I think it's good that they didn't totally... Uh, lower the requirements of me mechanics. Okay, yeah, fair enough. I know they're annoying. And it's one of those things where you're punished for not doing them rather than being rewarded yeah. for doing them, but... <laughs> okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah, I mean, I, I was kind of torn on that subject. I think there are really good arguments both ways, and that's why the community, I think, were also 50-50 on it. Half the people wanted them to yeah. leave it in, half the people wanted them yeah. to take it out, so... Yeah, I think it would yeah. have been fine both ways. Yeah! Yeah! Where am I going? Over here. I feel like I could do damage to something with the light from the sword. It's basically a laser at this point. Oh, yeah. I, I did figure that out yesterday, but I've been clicking furiously this time. Let me check my map. So, do you actually go all the way to the edges of the map, or are there mostly trees and stuff like that? So I guess where you can see the paths are basically where you'll go. Yeah, that's... Like, that would be cool if that was actually a strategy. If they made a game like this today, I'm sure that yeah. it would be in the game. Or if Hideo Kojima made the game or something like that. Alright, I hope I'm going the right way. Oh, really? Okay, cool. Uh, I've already been here. I've already been here. Did I go the wrong way? Oh, no. Ow. I've grown stuck. Okay, okay. Yeah. Just checking to make sure that there's no alternative paths yeah. this way. Yeah. <clears throat> what are you laughing at? And don't it makes me feel stupid. Don't don't ever just throw out a LOL there without any kind of context. <laughs> say to go. So I do have to go this way. No, I haven't figured them out. Yeah. Is there... are they explained at some point, or is it just something you figure out through exploration? Like, you get to where the beams are coming from. Where are they? It reminds me of uh, Halo in that respect. Ah, so I do have to go this way. But I've already been this way. Alright. Ah, oh, can you? Ah, oh, I'd like to do that. Yeah! Yeah! Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, I like when they don't. I really enjoy when things don't explain everything to you. Like. I mean, it depends on what it is. There are some things that. I mean, there's plot holes that need to be explained, and then there's, you know, environmental storytelling that if they just leave yeah, these yeah. question marks there and leave it to your imagination, like, it's great. Yeah, it's a really powerful effect. Yeah. Alright, I yeah. think I need to get off my horsey. Has Axe been swearing a lot? I haven't noticed. He does, X probably swears the most. Since I've put a ban on myself. I'm just gonna swim across this lake. You guys tell me if I'm being really stupid, please.
Are you Goldie with another pun? This isn't right, I'm not doing it right. I can hear my horse. I don't know which other way to go. Can I go up on the hill or something? I'm totally lost right now. Plus I'm also partially distracted by the chat. Look at <laughs> our just horsing about. You guys might have to just tell me where to go so I can squeeze in. No! So I can squeeze in one more Colossus before. Ah, uh, okay. I was, I was going to just swim through it, and it was probably going to be even lengthier, you know, assuming that even works. Ah. Uh, then had I fallen down into the valley in the previous game. There we go. Partially, partially playing. Yeah. I like yeah. the interaction. Oh, so I can get there through here. Does that involve swimming the whole way? Yeah. So you, I should probably exit out and go back like around the whole area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey. All right, I'm assuming this is the right way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, Goldie. Are you guys all right? What's going on back there? Is this is this right? Is this right? Okay, good. Because there's a delay, I'm worried you guys are like, yeah, finally you did it, and then but actually I've already gone past and done something stupid. Yeah. Kind of like when I was doing that puzzle in Undertale the other night. Ah, uh, there's a fork, there's a fork. Uh, it's just my, my wife, her, her brother, and his girlfriend. No parties, no parties. Uh, yeah, I think left. Looks like left. Can you see them? I don't know if you can see them. I mean, right, I think right is what I'm saying, not left. Yeah! I love when you hear the wind. Oh, there's a few little plants around here as well. Yeah! You wanna come? I can see one of them. Uh, yeah, you can see <coughs> the guy playing League of Legends right now. They might not understand. <laughs> hey, there was a graphical glitch just there. Uh, he says he is. Maybe he stopped. He was before. What is that? I nearly stomped on that lizard. Oh, okay. Is that... <laughs> is that the standard? Swearing in Polish? Hi, Jin! Yeah, I said hi for you, Goldie. Yeah, I understand. Hey, Benicorn's here! Oh, hi also to Benicorn. Um... I keep chatting to you guys and I'm getting lost. Yeah. And I absolutely know that Axe is getting really frustrated watching me. I can feel it. I can feel him judging me. Yeah. 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 Oh, my horse is tired. Let's just check out these ruins. Can I save game? Is this what do I actually do with these things? Or do they become unlocked at a later point or what?
Have you have you checked your uh, your family tree? Do you know your your lineage? Maybe you have some Polish in you. Yeah, I really enjoy the environment. It's actually quite peaceful and therapeutic. Uh, I do want to find some sunshine though. So uh, you become Polish. <clears throat> Hey, Benicon. We're all really well. Yeah. I'm slightly humiliated from getting yeah. my ass handed to me by a couple of these colossi, but... I'm trying to find some sunshine right now. How are you today, Benny? Oh, how did my horse yeah. get stuck here? Go, go, go. Yeah. He's slowly making his way yeah. down. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm trying to get yeah. some sunshine now so I can actually use my sword. Yeah. We're trying to squeeze... I've been playing for a couple of hours now, Benny. We're trying to squeeze in one more Colossus before for, the, for a uh, finish for the night. I can't see the sunlight at all. I think I have to go that way, though. Ooh, I can see four pillars of light now. Radiating into the sky. Yeah. Hey, this is where I came from, though, right? Do I take a wrong turn, or do I need to keep coming? Hey, what's up there? Are they just trees? Yeah, just dead trees. I think I need to go back. What? What about the first time you played the game, Goldie? Did you enjoy the exploration, or? Do you prefer just the killing of the Colossi? I think I enjoyed the exploration. And getting a little further out from home base each time you uh, go out to find one. Ah, uh, that's cool. <laughs> I have a lot of stuff to do too. It mostly involves sleeping, but I haven't been getting a lot of that lately. Yeah, like, I think I lean more towards what Asmo is saying here. Like, I feel like without the lulls, then the, uh, the moments of action would have a little less impact. In fact, I think they would have a lot less impact. I think it's a pretty nice balance. That's cool, Benny. Thanks for stopping in and saying hello. I haven't got that many followers yet, so it's, it's always very appreciated. It's cool just to it's cool just to have anyone tune in and say hello. To me it's still a real trip. I'm surprised that Asmo and Axe, you know, I'm friends with them in real life. I'm surprised that they're tuning in all the time. Plus, the game would also be really small. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, that's how I feel too, Leonton. Yesterday, Goldie? Did somebody say that? I feel like I've heard that before. Yeah! Even found these steps. Oh, I just ran my horse into a tree. Uh, Alright, let's slow down. Let's take a look at the map here. I've just done a full loop. Okay, I think I have to go right. struggles when it's on a, uh, an incline. It's 2.46 a.m. where I am. I'm from, I'm in Melbourne, Australia. Melbourne. What time is it where you guys are? In my mind, I think you're all, everyone is from the USA. It's 3 a.m. here, actually, we have daylight savings. No, it's, it's closer to 3 here. 
Unless my computer's just wrong. Am I going backwards yeah, again? Yeah. I'm telling yeah. you guys, it's 3 a.m. There's no debate here. Yeah. Oh, it's morning time. Uh, you guys are... Where are you from? You European? Yeah! Yeah, that can't be the time in the States. I have no idea where I'm going right now. I could be totally lost. Am I totally back to where I... I'm back where I came from! <laughs> Sweet. Ah, uh, cool. This is why uh, they tell you not to do math on stream. You're trying to figure out time zones and difference between our time and your time. USA. All right, I'm totally lost, guys. I kind of regret doing this last Colossus now. It's taken me 15 minutes and I haven't even found it yet. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, I thought you did have to be in direct sunlight. Why did I always think you had to be in direct sunlight? Alright, I'm going this way. Yeah! <clears throat> you. Oh. It was pretty obvious before that this was the direction as well. Yeah! I don't know how I missed it. Yeah! Ah, oh, you're from Louisiana. I actually work at a. Uh, yeah! I'm a chef by trade at the moment, so and I work at a uh, USA style barbecue place with southern southern style food, smoked meats and what have you. Yeah. I'm not sure if women like the southern accent though. I I couldn't tell you. I like the southern accent if that means anything to you, Goldie. Do they who loves Irish accents? What are you talking about? Actually, I think the Australian accent is probably one of the worst accents. So I guess maybe Australians would like any accent. But I think people all over the world like accents. Alright, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore, if it's even interesting. Alright, here we go, here we go. Irish. Everybody loves the Irish. Get a little bit of Irish in your love. Frank Underwood, yeah. yeah. What is his accent from? It's Southern USA, right? But like, specifically, what is he? Yeah. Like he's meant to be based on Bill Clinton, right? Like they're based on the Clintons mostly. Yeah. Am I going the right way? Did I get lost? Am I turned around again? What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? I think I'm too far away from the sun. Oh, oh, oh. Alright, I'm going this way. Depends on the. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. I know for me, if you get like a really strong Aussie accent, it's a, it's a big turn off, but I really wonder how a really strong Australian accent would fare in the uh, attraction game in another country. Where am I going? Have I been here before? Now it's telling me to go that way. Oh. Any help would be appreciated right now, guys. I feel like I need to go left from the way I'm facing right now. That's how I feel. Which is this way. Which is where I just came from, right? Yeah. 
Oh, I'm turning my horse the wrong way. Yeah. Frank Underwood, Southern Carolina. So do you sound like Frank Underwood, Goldie? I feel like you uh, you have this wit, Southern charm. With your puns. And some otherwise solid jokes. Uh, am I going the right way? I don't know if I'm going the right way at all. Is this, is this beginning to get frustrating, Esmo? Alright. You want to know how to be a mod? I don't know. Right now, the qualification is you need to know me in person. Because Asmo and uh, Axe both know me in person. Other than that, I haven't actually put any thought into it. I actually opened up the, the subreddit today for Twitch, and this, I saw that there was lots of information on making people mods and what your goals should be with your mods, but I haven't actually read it yet. That's, that's all research I guess I'm going to start doing. Get off the horse. Is this real advice, Esmond? Oh yeah, it looks like I can kind of climb up there. Is this the hill? Is this the correct hill? Seems to be pointing down. You're just guessing? Oh, you can't remember? No, I haven't read it yet. Ugh. I'm doing the diagonal climbing trick. Oh no, I can just run directly up there. I never even thought about climbing up any of these hills. Alright, I'm in sunlight now. Um, like... It's been like a week now? When did I start streaming? Oh, uh, it'd be two weeks now, probably. It originally started just kind of... I don't know, I just wanted to stream just to see what would happen, and it was... I wanted to hang out with uh, Asmo and Axe and we'd just play games together. So there's some multiplayer games of us playing Duck Game, and Axe and I like to play Insurgency, the team-based shooting game. And then uh, Asmo recommended I start playing Undertale, so I started doing that as a blind run, and then people started watching, I got some viewers. So now here I am, I'm streaming a bit more often. So I've got to do some research and um, kind of make it all a bit more professional. Try and spruce it up a bit and see what happens, see where I can take it. Because it, it's... <laughs> finding it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is difficult to get up here. I feel like... Uh... I need some kind of uh, Shadow of the Colossus expert to guide me. I think this is the HD remake, but it's not... It basically just looks like PlayStation 2 graphics to me. I don't know how much HD effort they put into the game. I think I'm about to die. <laughs> I feel like I'm humiliating myself right now. I'm, oh. Yeah, if you guys have any, um, if you guys have any streaming tips and techniques and anything you'd like yeah. to see or ways I can improve, I'm totally yeah. open-minded at this point. Okay, cool. Yeah, it does look very crisp. That's something I need to remember as well when I'm admiring and all like. Part of me is like, wow, this is a PlayStation 2 game, but it probably does look better than the PlayStation 2 game. Uh, yeah, I have the Elgato HD capture card. I'm playing on PS3, then it can't. Cherry Red PS3. Hey, am I back at the lake? Uh, 
Alright. Uh, let me just have a little look around here. Alright, okay. This, this has to be. Uh, uh, turn around, turn around. Full pixel mode in the Shadow of the Glosses menu. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Should I do that right now, you think? Or should I just do it next time? Wait, wait, I'll do it right now. I'm going to look for full pixel mode. Options. What's this full pixel, pixel mode you speak of? Is it in this menu? Oh, is it really a water one, Esmond? Uh, full pixel mode, alright. So you want me to turn it off or on? What did you say? Activate full pixel mode. Alright. Ah, okay. Wow, why did nobody mention that to me before? Whoa, we have a full picture now. Alright, right now, okay. Whoa, that actually looks... Whoa, where am I now? I found something. I'm gonna get off this horse. Yeah, this looks way more impressive right now. I'm playing on a fairly small monitor too, so it's quite a large difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I found it, and basically all by myself. What was all this business telling me to, get, to go back to the lake, Asma? Whoa, my horse just tried to assassinate me! Okay, yeah, that's cool. Well, any kind of tips... Yeah, I'll, I'll take any kind of tips or suggestions. I'm willing to try anything at this point. And I mean anything. Wow, this is cool. Agra's on their side. Yeah, he, they turned him. They turned her? They turned her. Yeah, I... Yeah, I think so. I do have quite a fast internet speed, though. At least for Australians, by Australian standards. Oh, that's a giant screw. What is that in the water? Why is my camera turning around? Why can I hear? Oh, oh, it's trying to kill me again. Oh, all right, it's a standoff now. Um, all right, let's have a look here. Whoa, camera problems. Alright, I'm going to assume I need to get up there. Uh, my service provider tells me that I get 100 Mbps, but uh, the maximum the maximum I'll ever get will be around 35 to 38 Mbps. And that's at off-peak time, so probably around about this time in the morning I should be getting my maximum speed. Uh, if I were to stream during the day, it would probably go down to as low as 10 to 15, maybe lower at some really awkward points, but actually, yeah, I should check my... Oh, Benny <laughs> Alright, sh I can tell shit's gonna go down. This was far too epic a journey for this to just be an anti-climax. Alright, I'm at the top. Might be slicing this tree up. <laughs> I think my upload speed is similar. It might be slightly faster, actually. I can probably do a test. We'll do a test when I shut the stream off, and I'll... Next time we can, um, talk about it, I guess. I can't really see where to go. Am I going into the water? Do I have to dive off here? Jump for it into the water? Yeah, that's what... Is that it? Is that the monster there? Man, that's creepy. I don't want to... Yeah, I'll do the speed test. I can probably... Uh, I can't do the speed test now. I'm probably lagging, right? Maybe I can. I don't know. I'll do a, I'll do a speed test right now. Let's see how it goes. Oh, oh, I need to bring 
bring back the Twitch. So this thing's probably gonna kill- if I die, I'm, I'm gonna stop streaming, just so you know. I'm not gonna find my way all the way back here. Do I need to ride it like it's one of the sandworms from Dune? Can I grab on? Can I grab on? It's getting away! Zapping me? Alright, I'm on. I'm on. How do I move? Oh, I can only move when he surfaces. Yo, I fell again. <laughs> okay, you here. Look, that's not fair, Goldie. You, you already knew. I'm doing this shit blind, man. It's not easy. I should have known. I should have known there'd be some underwater aspects here. But is this the full play you were talking about? The mermaid? I don't think so. That's cool, Benny. Thanks for stopping by. I'll probably be streaming tomorrow night. Maybe a similar time. Hopefully a little bit earlier. Whoa, I just went sad. Nan's hands. Ah, I just never played this game before. And in fact, I know very little about it. So that's what we mean by blind. Welcome to the stream, by the way, Nan's hands. We're up to eight streamers. Cool. Oh, eight, eight viewers. Alright. Here we go. Oh, did he zap me? Cool. Can I stab it underwater? No. Current such is drunk. Ah! His, oh, his monster juice just. Run to the next one. Come on, run, run, run. Oh, grab on, grab on. Please don't have fallen off. Yes. Bang. Oh, it's so peaceful when you go off. <clears throat> that moment when he went underwater was really peaceful. It'd be really cool if like the music died out. Oh, he's really trying to drown me. Ah, oh, he got me. Am I dying? Oh, my health is getting low. Swim. Am I just dying? Am I just gonna die? Oh, I'm so just right. No, so, sorry to disappoint you, Nan's hands. I guess that would be kind of spectacular if that were possible. I know somebody at one of the uh, AGDQs, the Awesome Games Done Quick, did a blindfold run of Zelda. Oh, wait. It wasn't, I don't think it was the real Zelda, was it? It might have been one of the uh, one of those expansion things, but that was still mighty impressive. How do I get this thing to surface? Oh, it's just going to come up there. That's so creepy. Can he eat me? Is he going to take a bite out of me? Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Yes. Really? 
that have you seen a blindfold speedrun on um, Shadow of the Colossus? How about this? Next, I, I should have done this as literally a blind run, so without any prior knowledge and a blindfold, seeing how long it took me to uh, finish the game. I think I could do it within three years. Oh, was it really at Max? Are there VODs of that? I'd love to see that. Is AD, is the um, AD, AGDQ still going? What if it hasn't finished? That's actually one of my favorite things to watch being stream. I think I like the variety. Okay, yeah. Let's see how that goes. I feel like maybe the, um, the flowey fight could be done blindfold, but I feel like there wasn't that much skill involved in that. I gotta get to this final tentacle. Ah, no, 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 please, please! Okay, I'm on, I'm still on. Oh, my neck is getting sore. As much as. Oh, okay, okay. As much as I'm enjoying the game, I am also looking forward to not playing it all the time. Alright, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Bam! <laughs> nice, that's a lot of money. It surprises me how much money that can be raised by this thing. Like, it, it's really, it feels to me like it's really just raising the legitimacy of video games. Our form in the mainstream. I guess legitimacy is kind of a dumb thing to talk about, but you know what I mean. Both. Yeah, the flowery fight felt like a fight that um, you're not really meant to lose. The Asgore fight definitely seemed more difficult. Oh. Come on. Man, I stabbed him as he was going back into the water. That was sweet. Oh, he's almost dead. Alright, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. The music cut out. He's still alive. Oh. oh, he's taking me under. I gotta let go. Nah, I gotta let go. Come on, swim for it. Swim for it. Talking about me? Have I died? Oh yeah, I. Oh, you meant in the in Undertale. Yeah, I. I don't know. I think I only died because the deaths in that. He just brings you back and you continue fighting against him, right? So it's not even really a real death. Oh, is it really? Sometimes at this time of night, my internet cuts out inexplicably, so it might be getting to that stage where it's just, it's going to stop working, so that could be why it's getting laggy. It could also be because my roommate is hugging bad, but I'm not sure. I don't really understand the complexities of the internet service providers. Ah, I didn't get him. Yeah, hopefully it's just temporary. Yeah, this, oh, so you don't even know this game, obviously. Um, yeah, this is basically, so far as I can tell, it's just a, a vast empty world filled with giant boss battles. And so the purpose of the game is to explore and get to the next boss and figure out how to kill the boss and then overcome it. Um, I guess you've basically, you've been watching, you've basically seen what the game is about. But it's, I don't know, it sounds a little dull when you describe it that way, because I think a large part of this game is the aesthetic. No, 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 he can watch. He can watch him play. I, I need as many viewers as I can get. Alright, here we go. Yeah. What? 
I also think my aimlessly looking for one. Was, I mean, the aimlessness of it was compounded by the fact that I was chatting to you guys as well. I think. But yeah, there's no small battles in this game. They're all large battles. And I think the point of the game is, is the aesthetic. Like, every fight has this real epic, spectacular feel to it. It's, it's hard to capture in words in a way that really uh, quantifies it. He's almost dead. Oh! I just dropped under the water. Oh, that actually just... Oh, that made me jump. He really doesn't want me to get there. I think I gotta jump. I think I gotta leap. Oh, no, I leaped too far. I leaped too far. Wow, he really doesn't want me to get here. Okay. Yeah, this fight is probably the best one yet, I think. Oh, he's taking me underwater again. Oh, no, no, grab on, grab on. Please grab on. Please, please. Yeah. Yeah, it might also be my stream. If my stream inexplicably cuts out, just know that I'm sorry. Uh, it happens sometimes when I play too long. I'll usually try and finish the stream by now, but I did just want to get one more boss in tonight. Alright, here we go, here we go. Alright. Yes, yes, I made it, I made it. Here we go. Guys, one. He's dead. Good mince meat, pal. Bam! Oh, that one felt really good. You've never seen him do that? That was intense. We first, did you see it on stream the first few times he did it? I actually just went, ooh, like I felt like my body was going with me. Yeah, one of the awesome things about this game, all these it really accomplishes a sense of scale, so you can really feel how huge these, these uh, colossi are, and I think that's kind of the most crucial element of the game. Like, the whole game probably fails if it doesn't accomplish that. I think. I mean, I'm not even halfway through. Thanks, guys. I made it. That felt really good. I guess now I'll go back to base, and then I'll be looking to this. Head to sleep. Whoa! That scared me, man. <laughs> it happened before, though. I think because I'm partially distracted by you guys, too. Alright. I'm going to save it, guys. And I'm probably going to call it a night. Uh, any of you guys, like Ollie or... Who else is here? Leontin? Uh, feel free to follow. It was great talking to all of you. Had a lot of fun. And I'm going to be back almost definitely tomorrow night. But I'll be streaming pretty regularly from now on. And I'd love to hear any kind of feedback from you guys about ways to improve the stream. Or you know what I can be doing better, what I can be doing wrong, games I can play, all that kind of stuff. Yeah, I'll be planning to do Undertale this week as well. Um, maybe even tomorrow night. It doesn't have to be Shadow of the Colossus every time. Oh yeah, let's check the internet speed before I go. Alright, do the test. I'm still, I wonder if the streaming will impact this heavily because of my like... Okay, right now I'm sitting at around about... Okay, it's still going up. Okay, it looks to be averaging around about 22. 22 Mbps, a ping of 3. 23.39 was the peak, I think. Uh, we're about to do the upload speed. <clears throat> Very similar, slightly more. We're looking at 28, 29, we hit 30, 31, 
33. We hit 33.14. So actually, that's quite a, quite a difference between upload and download. Is that really Asmo? Is that you think that's homage? Yeah, I think it's because I live. In, I mean, my guess is because I live in an apartment, uh, uh, an apartment complex. So based on what Asmo was telling me, where you know I'm going to be sharing bandwidth probably with the whole building, right? So. I like how total goldfish has now just become goldy. Phalanx. So which one is Ares? Or Aerie? Or... I really want, want to kill Ares. Oh really? Cool. Phalanx. <laughs> Are you just making this up, Asma? Alright, well, I'm really looking forward to Aries then. Okay, okay, save the game. Cannot forget to save it. Alright, I'm going to cut the stream off, guys. Thanks for joining me. Wait, how do I stop? Okay, here we go. And... Oh, wait. Make sure I save it. Make sure I save it. Alright. Good night, everyone.